Good day, friends. Welcome back to Smart Weekend. Here's another problem. The problem asks us to find the value of x in the expression below for which it is undefined. That means for what value of x is the expression undefined. Here's the main point. So for we to deal with an expression like this or a fraction like this to find the undefined, right? We need to pick the denominator, right? So if we take the denominator and equate it to zero we, we are trying to find the undefined state right or if we take the numerator right and we equate it to zero we are finding the what the defined state so in this case what we are trying to do is to find the undefined state so therefore we take the denominator right and the denominator is this right which is x squared plus x minus 20. So the next thing we need to do here is that we need to solve for this, right? The first thing here, we know the coefficient of x squared is 1, right? So if we take this coefficient 1 and this value of 20, uh, we have 1 times negative 20, which is equal to negative 20. Now the thing we need to look for here is that what value we multiply together will give us negative 20. And when we add it or subtract it, it's going to give us the coefficient of x here so let's pick two values so let's take five now is five going to take the negative sign or four let's say we give five the negative sign and four the positive sign five times four will be 20 then times the negative negative 20 which is kind of similar to this well, let's see when we add it together if it is going to give us a value of 1, right? Which is for the coefficient of the 1 above. So let's say minus 5 plus 4. You see, we get negative 1. So it is not going to work. So what we need to do here is that we need to change the sign. We take 5 and negative 4. So we end up having negative 20. Then when we what subtract this value, we have what? 1. So let's substitute into the equation above. We have x squared plus 1x minus 20. So we can rewrite that as x squared plus x minus 20 it can be rewritten as x squared plus 5x minus 4x minus 20. As you can see that this is still going to give you 1x, isn't it? So we can say, okay, let's group this like this, right? So we factorize it, x will come out plus which means for the first part the second will be negative 4 right open bracket x plus 5 so we say that we have x minus 4 which is this value and this value I will pick one out of this bracket which is what x plus 5 so now we need to equate this to 0 since the absence to find for what value of x is the expression going to be undefined so x minus 5 equals 0 and also x plus 5 right equals 0 so therefore x equal to 4 in this case or x equal to negative 5 in this case right therefore the value at which x is undefined is x equal to 4 comma negative five. Hope the concept is clear. If there's any question, feel free to ask me.